Molly Donahoe. I'm from America and currently playing with the SEALs. I'm 22 and am an attacker. Um, I've been involved in water polo since I was 10 years old, so a little over 12 years now. Um, my favorite water polo memory probably has to be playing in the national championship with UCLA. Um, unfortunately, we didn't lose, but just being in that atmosphere, especially with the team that I was playing with, it's just an incredible moment and you can't really beat that feeling. Playing in Australia is pretty similar to playing in America. We don't actually have kind of like semi-professional leagues where you can play once you're out of college. So that is definitely like a different feel, but it's still the same game, even if it's in a different country. And I feel like everyone kind of plays by the same rules still, so it's definitely not too big of an adjustment. Since I've been here, it hasn't been too hard to adjust. I think it really helps that we all speak English, so that's a big thing. And other than that, everyone's been really helpful to kind of make it easy to get adjusted to, so that's good. Yeah, I'm excited for the Pride Cup. Um, it sounds like it's going to be a huge event, and I love playing in front of a bunch of people, so I think it's going to be exciting to support such a great cause and be able to do it in front of thousands of people. I think we're just trying to focus on our game and continue to grow as a team and continue to get better and kind of understand each other as teammates. We're obviously still going through learning each other and I think these next couple weeks until then we're going to continue doing that. I think that I've definitely kind of reached all mine currently. I'm not planning to go to the Olympics so I think my water polo aspirations are just to enjoy it and kind of end it on a good note. Definitely think that it's been great being here with the SEALs so just to have fun and enjoy every moment. Um, I want to go back home and my next aspirations are to become a teacher. I want to teach some subject for probably fourth graders. I think that that's a perfect age for me to teach. My water polo hero would probably have to be my assistant coach from UCLA, Molly Cahill. Um, I just really respected how much she's put into the game and she just always had such a great attitude and she created so many awesome memories and I think that the way she did it was obviously the best way to do a water polo career and so I respect that and have always admired it. I didn't actually know much about both obviously beyond Blue Cup and we have like a couple pride events in America but I think just as an import it's been really unique experience for me because I'm learning all about it and it's been extremely cool how the SEALs are doing this and teaming up with them because I wouldn't have known about these different um, situations and so I think that it's cool that I get like a personal um, up close like experience with it and I'm definitely leaving here with more knowledge about it and can continue spreading that awareness as well. I actually yes I have played on live television a bunch of my games back home for college were on live television so it's an awesome experience. It's pretty weird to go back and watch yourself though, that's for sure. Um, I'm just excited to be here and playing with the SEALs and I think it's an extremely awesome thing that they're doing and I'm very excited to be a part of it, so thank you.